Uh, we're back again, and we have a beautiful young lady as a guest next, and her name is Michelle Halstead. Michelle. Hi. So glad to have you here. Thank you. Um, like you said, my name is Michelle Halstead, and I am an artist creator, and I've been a dance instructor for over 18 years. Wow. Yeah, so um, today I kind of want to talk a little bit more about my art. Um, uh -huh. It's been in different galleries in San Francisco, in L.A. Wow. And um, uh, I think one of my favorite pieces that I got to do was for the Tulare County um, District Attorney's Office. Wow. They, um, uh, I labeled that piece Restoring Hope. They, when they asked me to do a piece, um, I wanted to dedicate a piece to victims of crime oh. and the people that um, who bring justice to the victims so that was one of my latest pieces that I've done um, oh. that I was really proud of did you bring any in for um, I have some on um, some of the art pieces that's a piece that I did with ink so um, I painted uh, water on paper and then I just poured the ink over it, so wow. that's Jack Nicholson. Yeah, and there's, I recognized uh, him. <laughs> Bob Marley. Mm. So this piece has been in different galleries, um, in some of my art shows in San Francisco and LA. That one's spray paint. Spray paint, I don't know <laughs> how you could do that with spray paint. Um, I use uh, different tools to block off the different areas. Oh. So when I am spraying, I'm moving around and adjusting the different, um, adjusting the paper to where it will block off different spots to get the fine lines. Wow, that's interesting. Oh, look at this, that's pretty. Is that an umbrella behind her? No, oh, it was. You like to do ladies, I see. Yes, I do a lot of ladies. <laughs> and um, whenever I paint, I uh, paint what I've dreamed the night before. So um, I, uh, when I, a lot of times when I'm dreaming, I'm dreaming in gold. So I dream a lot about the element gold and um, just the color and being in. Uh, surrounded by gold, so golden, a lot of my golden dreams. <laughs> golden <laughs> dreams. So, a lot of my paintings have um, oh, a lot that. of gold. Yeah, that's a bison. Beautiful. That was spray paint too, actually. Wow, they're so unique. Mm, I, I love that. I love that. Look at that. Yeah, this is beautiful. Gosh, how you could do that with spray is beyond me. It took some practice. I guess it did. And it gets messy. <laughs> but it's, it's fun. It's definitely fun, and it's a passion that I have. So. Okay, when did your passion for art start? Um, when I was, I think, five, <laughs> I had a teacher, um, Cheryl Schellenberg. She is still an art teacher for um, Fresno. Really? Yeah, and um, she just put... Uh, watercolors in front of me and um, I just started just going just using all of her paper up and um, she thought that it was really good so she um, put it in some art competitions for me wow. at that young of an age and um, ever since then she really inspired me and to just keep pursuing you oh, know the creative side that's so wonderful because it can be heartbreaking at times so. yeah then you just have to say, I gotta keep going. <laughs> yeah, yeah, you just gotta keep going. It's one of those things that I can't stop doing. So, uh -huh. yeah. And, and when did you get interested in the dance? The dance, I started when I was three. My mom put me in <laughs> um, tap, ballet, and gymnastics. And then since I was three, I've never stopped. Um, once I was old enough, I got um, a job teaching dance, and I've taught everywhere. I've taught in um, the valley. And um, I've taught just all, all over California. That's amazing, because so. I have a grandniece named uh, 
Scarlet, mm -hmm. and she decided she wanted to be a ballerina. Oh, yeah. So they took her about a week ago, they took her to her first lesson, they had gave her a little pink tutu oh, yes. and everything, uh -huh. yeah. and I got this picture of it. She's just like, oh my gosh, I, I'm yeah. full of joy, you know? Yes, definitely. I'm sure you must have been full of joy, too. Oh, definitely. The three-year-olds are definitely extremely cute. Yeah. More, and um, I teach from three to any age. I think the oldest I've had before is 63. Mm -hmm. um, most people come into the studio and they want tap, ballet, and um, I did a lot of acrobatics and contortioning, so... Oh. A lot of people come to me for that, but um, I could teach anything. I've gotten some ballroom, people coming in <laughs> wanting ballroom. That is great. Things, Are you so. still teaching? Yeah, that? I still teach. And yeah. where do you teach? I teach um, right now. I currently teach in Dinuba. It's oh, um, Dinuba. with K School of Dance. Oh, is that, too um, bad we don't have you here. <laughs> I have been here before. <laughs> I have taught in Fresno before, oh, God, but right now I'm just great. in Dinuba. Okay, so the main thing right now that was art. Your heart is in that right now too. Huh? Yes. Uh huh. Yeah. So I'm I'm just amazed at what you've been able to do, and I want to uh, find out where people could buy some of um, your. Um, you can get a hold of me by my phone number, or you can find me on Facebook. Um, if you type in Michelle L. Halstead, you can look me up and message me or friend request me. Well, I'm sure some, some people would like some of the, that artwork. It's really totally different and wonderful. So come in again the okay. next time Definitely. you're doing something that we want to hear about. And I, I've had I've just had a good time with you. Definitely. Thank you. Me too. Okay, honey. We'll be right back. <laughs> 